Tim with Soda Milsim here to show you the Sandpiper deployment bag. As you can see, it's about the size of your standard airport luggage. It's 36 inches long, so it's too big to go in your carry-on, but it is checked baggage size. Like most airport luggage, you have wheels on the bottom. This has three wheels instead of your standard two. Instead of a plastic handle that pops out the top, Sandpiper has two handles, one at the bottom and one at the top that can be used to haul it around like so. On the bottom there's rails for rigidity and there's a plastic sheet in the back to keep shape. On the side there's three pockets, two are sewn in that will fit about half of an MRE each and then one which is mullet on which will fit one full MRE. You can fit a couple of cans of gas in the bigger pocket. Along the top, there's a fairly standard duffel bag handles, but the uh, padding and the material is really beefy. I think they expect you to carry a lot of weight with this. The bag the bag can carry almost everything you need for a 48-hour event. On the inside, there's organizers in the lid with mesh, and there's organizers with mesh with zippers along both edges here. Now if you pack light, you can fit everything you need for a 48-hour event into this bag. If you pack a little bit heavier or you have an extremely bulky sleeve system, you'll, you might need an extra bag. But I'm just showing you uh, this is a, what a really light 48-hour event loadout looks like using a plate carrier and a helmet. Now obviously if you're using a chest rig and a soft cover, you're frontline gear is going to weigh a lot less, it's going to be a lot less bulky. Uh, so you probably could easily fit your 48 hours of gear right into this one bag. Since it is 36 inches long, it easily fits the carbine rifle. So pick yourself up some luggage and uh, go traveling and seeing, some, seeing the sights in the U.S. and go to some Milsim events somewhere besides where you live.